Are we good? I don't know. Who knows? It works. Wait, it doesn't work. No, it works. It works. All right, it works. It works. <laughs> nice. Uh, which one else? Stop. Oh, it works. I'm stuff. Stop. Nice, it works. Perfect. Did I turn back to my time zone? No, I didn't. Holy crap! Whoa, okay, that was fast. <laughs> welcome, welcome, Circus. I didn't expect someone to join that fast. <laughs> Maybe it's sort of selling a cold dish. Circuit. Whoa, what the fuck? I don't need to leave it, you know? Hands <laughs> on. Welcome, Magic. Jesus, I. This is the fastest people has ever joined to the stream. Uh, that is unexpected. If I may say so. Some things. Uh, hold on. Uh, what's, what's going on? Don't spoil the game, level or death. Hold on, hold on, circus, circus. You don't have to be like that. We're all friends in here. No one's gonna spoil anything, all right? So let's just chill out with the with the with that. I know it's it's a joke, but for others it might not be a joke. Um, I'm great. I was scared that when I'll wake up, I finish the game. I don't think so. Like, still a lot of the game left. If that's what like people told me that there's a lot of the game left, so I don't think you'll miss it because you. Dually stream at zero and it's time for me. Oh, yeah, but this time is different because I'm not gonna stream tomorrow. So I decided I, I, was pl I, I wasn't gonna stream this week. But um, I, I didn't have plans streaming this week because of like I'm busy with work and some projects. But uh, I decided at the end that I was gonna stream a little. Uh, oh my goodness, man. It's my boyfriend to leave. Our friends until the spoilers come in. No, even if the spoilers come in, like I, I can just time out whoever spoils the game, and that's it. But, but there's no need for violence. They want me to spoil my turbo. <laughs> All right. Now I'm just gonna set some things up. I'll be right back.
I think that I'm set, kind of. Oh no, still need to do this. This. Okay. Alright, good. Same. working? Is it? It is working. Alright, nice. Uh, those, don't worry, those the, those were from my computer. If you're watching it, your computer, that, that, that's not from your computer, so don't worry. Um, right, we got this, we got this. I think, I think we already set. Might be set. All right, time to catch up with chat. Um, no friends here. I'm gonna spoil people, but I spoil myself and stuff. <laughs> My bread isn't working. Oh no, it is working. It is. <laughs> yeah, I I managed to get my Twitch emotes approved by Twitch. But I mean, those are just placeholders. I'm gonna I'm gonna replace those emotes later because uh, I don't know if. I already mentioned this with some of you, but uh, I'm planning to like do a overhaul of the entire channel this winter after I get done with job and stuff that I'm doing. So yeah, I'm just doing, I'm just putting placeholders in the meantime, and later I'm gonna put like better emotes on the channel. <laughs> red coins, <laughs> indeed, red coins. Do you want me to tell you about red coins? <laughs> I'm not gonna do that soon already. I'm not gonna do that so soon. All right. I need to manage this. You told me you wanted. You told me you wanted to draw my logo. Wait, did I? I did. Hold on. You still want to do it, please? And have a computer. Oh yeah, I I did. But I thought you were gonna draw it because you told me that you were gonna do it. But yeah, I'm I'm I'm, I'm down. I'm I'm down to do it. No problem. If the audio is right, change the clothes. Yeah, sure. I'll do it. No problem. All right. Okay, everything is working fine. Time to start the game. Here we go. One that I wanted to capture. It's this is the one that I wanted to capture. All right, so what do we got? Speakers, winner. There we go. Now the game's crash. No, it's not crash. What the fuck? Okay, it's not crash. That's a good. That's a good thing. All right, here we go. It's been. It, it's always weird coming back to stream because it's like it's a one week between streams, and every time that I come back to stream, it's like, what am I doing? Like, I I I feel like I'm in a strange place. Because I'm not streaming every day or like every so often. It's just like once a week. And every time that I come back, is I feel like I'm in an alien planet whenever I, I stream because I don't know what to do. And I need to get used all over again. Um, do you need the picture? Yeah, sure. Uh, you can send me the picture. Uh, we can talk about that later. Uh, magic. But yeah, I'll be down to do your picture. Yeah, it's just gonna take uh, some time because I'm busy at the moment, but I'll do it when I get free time. Ooh, but I don't know. I got another one. Well, you can do whatever you want. Oh, wait, what? Oh, yeah, I renabled this in the patch. I forgot that I did this. All 
Okay, I renable I renable the demo in the starting screen. But apparently it's broken. <laughs> Alright. Oh hello Rose, welcome to the stream. Welcome back again. It's nice to see you. That was nice to see you here. Welcome, welcome. Oh, ad. Wait, what the fuck? There's an ad. There's an ad playing. I I I thought that I disabled ads on my chat. I, I, I thought that I disabled ads on my channel. It's probably it's just Twitch. Like, if I can find a way to disable ads on the channel, I'll do it. But I mean, it's probably Twitch just messing around with me. Okay. Uh, all right. Let me just catch up real quick. Um. Hey, Rose. Uh, I remember playing it when I was twelve. But I don't remember. Oh, so to you, <laughs> we're aliens. No, it's not that you're aliens. It's whenever I come back to stream, streaming feels like I'm traveling to an alien world because it's, it, it's odd. Oh, yeah, I left in here. You're in a strange place. <laughs> yeah, just, just kidding. Ah, okay, we will... Uh it's okay. It gives, it gives you money. Wait, what? It, it gives you. Well, I mean, sure, it's nice having money, but I mean, I don't like. I don't know. I feel like having ads on the channel takes my viewers away from the game, and I don't want that because I feel like they're gonna miss part of the game. But uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I forgot. Oh, sorry about that. Welcome everyone to the stream. We're here back on Angel of Darkness, and. Sadly, we end, we finished the last stream on a, on a, on a, on a goddamn cliffhanger. Because, for those who don't know, and for those who haven't played, spoiler alert, but, um, Curtis died. And that really broke my heart, because I was not expecting that one. It was, and it was one of the worst ways to end the stream, too, because, like, I didn't want, I didn't want it to live there. That was close. But, yeah. Kurt is dead, and now we're playing as Croft. And I'm just so confused because it was out of the out of nowhere. It was out of the blue, and it really caught me off guard. But all right, with that now out of the way of where we left off, our objective right now is to get to fucking, you know, the guy with a weird hand and kill him for his atrocities, for turning the girl into a monster and being responsible for Curtis dead. Even though that was the woman monster, it's still the guy's fault for turning the woman into a monster. Because if that wouldn't happen, Curtis would still be alive. All right, now with that out of the way, um, okay, Circus Baby, truth or dare. All right, well, um, truth or dare. Truth. I'm gonna go with truth on this one. We stand Curtis dying. No, no, we don't. I love Curtis. Well, I, I despise him a little bit, but I, 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 I grown up enough to like have some respect for the guy. This is not that for me. I don't want to spoil. What's going on now? Oh, you're near... Wait, what? Near the end, I guess? Wait, am I? I thought My there was a lot of... Stronger. Maybe I'll make that jump. I thought there was a lot of the game left. Oh, don't tell me that I need to time it. Wait, do I need to time it? Do you... Do you really like Curtis, or are you... No, I really like the guy, like... It... Also, something that I realized from last stream is that I say like a lot. I need to change that. I was watching some of the highlights of last stream, and it was like, 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 like... And I was like... See, there I go again, saying like. I, I don't know why I do that. Okay, so I can't make the jump like that. Oh my god, eight viewers, what the hell is going on? <laughs> I never had so many viewers this early. Uh, 
<laughs> but uh, yeah, a lot of things is going on. Um, Chris was my crush when I was younger. <laughs> Shoneka, leave these spill bots. No, 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 hold on. No need to freak out. No need to freak out, alright? No need to freak out. Leave Tricana alone. It's, it's okay if I'm okay uh, already near the ending, but there's no need to freak out, Sharkas. Alright, Sharkana, you're okay. Don't worry. Who's Foil? He's one of the few men compatible for Lara. No <laughs> man is compatible for Lara. No, hey, 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 Circus, calm down, calm down. No, Sharkana, you didn't spoil anything, don't worry. Alright. I didn't want it to be this guy, but Circus, if you don't calm down, you're gonna get a timeout. So don't worry, Charkana, you are you are a okay. Alright, on my terms. Hold on, what the hell is going on? Okay, so that opens and I need to rush over there. Oh my god, okay. Pretty sure that I'm doing something wrong. It it's not it doesn't stay open that much. Try sprint. That's a thing. I can sprint and jump. <laughs> no, I can't. I what? Wait, whoa, 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 I can do that? Nobody told me. Like, what? Good call on you, Rose, once again. Seriously, thanks again, Rose. Holy crap, I didn't know you could do that. That's amazing. All right, well, um, hold on. Just give me a moment, just give me a moment. Where did I left the notes? Let me just get the... Where did I left the paper with the... Just right. Just give me a moment. I have a perfect thing for this. All right. Hope this works. And wait, is it control alt plus? All right. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. That's not. That's not. This one. It's the. <laughs> Come on, get your head straight, gamer. Okay, the music is not helping. It's it's <laughs> This is not going to be easy at all. I love that jump. Yeah. <laughs> it's really cool. I didn't expect that I can do that. Try Age of Darkness on a PC again. Well, good luck, Sharkana, with that. Because honestly, from what I'm hearing, uh, on PC is better because of the loading times. And I forgot to like save. All right, it's time to ride. All right, here we go. Wait, what? Oh, I can reset it. 
Yeah. <laughs> I'm using glitches with the save function. Function. All right. Um. All right. Time to catch up. Uh. But, um, it's okay. I never knew that. Very busy. feels like freedom. Yeah, it actually does. It looks amazing. Can I? This Star Wars sound. Why is Star Wars sound? No, it's Indiana Jones. Like you're on PC. I feel this area. In hey, hey, hey. How's it going, Lucky? Welcome to the stream. Isn't that I'm going to have to use this to go around because the middle doesn't look that like I can trust it. I can definitely, yeah, I'm definitely taking this way. I'm not going through the middle. <laughs> not in a million years. Look, okay, please don't spoil. Okay, don't worry. Don't worry, Circus. Luck is not going to spoil. Save. Oh, no. I'm sorry, wrong movie. <laughs> Circus is pro. Yeah, it's not spoiling. Chat. Yeah, I mean, Circus, you don't have to tell everyone to don't spoil because, like, Everyone can see in the in the text that there's the the blind playthrough. Uh I'll I'll take that jump. I don't know how I managed to make it, but I'll take it. Son of a Yeah. Uh yeah. Huh. So far, good. Thank you. Just a bit sleepy. Oh, I'm great. Thanks. Uh, if you're tired, well, try catching some rest. I mean, you don't have to stay here if you don't want to. But I mean, if you want to, go ahead. But remember that sleep is important, dude. I'll be quiet also. No, don't be quiet, dude. You're always welcome in chat. Everyone is welcome in chat. I actually encourage everyone to be in chat. It's just nice having people around. Not even once. Oh. All right, I got a funny idea. No, it didn't work. Why suddenly the whole place is movie trapped? But I think that I know where to go. Kind of. I doubt that I can go here. Oh yeah, it doesn't look like I can. Now, nah, right? Can I climb this? Okay, that's a long way to fall. Jump over? Yeah, I'm, I, I think that I can jump over, but I mean, I don't have like, <laughs> I, 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 um, I, I don't, I don't think that I can. I, I tried it, but uh, probably I need to do a backwards jump. I mean, the camera pans this way and that looks like something that I can grab and climb I doubt it I probably can it's gonna take a while I'll be quiet just oh, hold on let me just take this away please don't crash Please don't crash. I beg you, game. I love you now, but I mean, sometimes you make me pull my hair. Also, be quiet. I just became a pancake. That's steak. Oh, there's no one spoiled. This is right. Everyone is welcome. Even if they spoil the game, I mean, even if they spoil the game, Rose is gonna just time them out, and that's it. 
Everyone is welcome in the chat. Uh, it's in the morning here. <laughs> So, yeah, I have to go around. Well, good luck and... Uh, well, I wish you the best of luck when you go to work, Lucky. Eat uh, mm. You need to turn off the trap. Most men start balding at the age of 35. Balls soon are playing. Of darkness and pulling your hair out. <laughs> and to turn off the trap. Turn off the trap. Uh, I see. I didn't notice that at first. Jeez. I didn't notice that at first. I, I, I swear, I look up there and it was empty. Did he just spawn out of nowhere? Maybe. Just maybe. There's other rocks. I'm in the UK. Oh, nice. Another person from around the world. They're always welcome. Right, time to try it out. Yeah, I mean, we have people from around the world in here. I mean, I'm from Mexico, you're from the UK. Uh, heaven is from, like, two people from Canada. It's amazing how Angel of Darkness can bring people together from all around the world. Or not just Angel of Darkness, people from, like, streaming, basically, can feel, all right. Nothing happened. <laughs> Can bring people from around the world <laughs> together. Alright, good. Now that. <laughs> nothing to see. <laughs> yeah, nothing happened. Y'all saw nothing. Did I nail it? I did it! Oh, it, 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 it would be so cool if I did. Where, 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 where is it? Bingo! Oh. Hell yeah! Easy peasy. You don't want to call me easy peasy? Okay. I forgot where was the last time that I saved. Oh no, wait. Here it is. Uh, do I? This one. Jump down. Yeah, that was close. <laughs> really close. <laughs> Bingo. Hell yeah. Oh, Eckhart Slot. That's the name of the guy. Son of a bitch is gonna go down as soon as I get my hands on him. Okay. Sweet jeez! I wasn't counting that one. <laughs> I wasn't counting that there was gonna be something there. Okay, so, uh. jump. Just jump. Let's go! I forgot. Oh. Okay, you know that. There. Hi. Jesus Christ. Nice 
BDSM basement. Not my taste, but I ain't gonna judge. Gonna jump steam, yeah. I love using that whenever there's like traps or anything related. It's kind of fun. Okay, there's a lever there. I ain't gonna push it yet. I wanna, I wanna look around the place. There's probably some hidden passage, or something. And if I say this, but the new largest was actually supposed to have a lot of levels connected without loading screens. Oh, sweet. Okay, we got a bile or something. With the music again, that once you realize there is no more trap. <laughs> yeah, and once I realize it, it's a basement with some kinky shit in here too. By the way, what is this? Items. That's a lot of stuff that I have. Alchemy, oh. Alchemia. My, maybe we get some skooma in here. Eh. <laughs> okay. Time to go up. Wait, hold on. Okay, maybe I do need to pull the lever. Hey, oh nice. I wonder if someone can mod. So there's loading screens. Mm. Maybe. Maybe they can do that, Rose. But I mean, you'll have to do that with a lot of tweaking with the engine. Got a funny feeling. Yeah, I knew it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm never gonna be a fan of that sound. Every time that she dies underwater, it's like... I don't know, it, it's creepy, it's weird, it's terrifying. You can feel the dead, gentlemen. Ah, uh, you know what? Just come here, come here, come here, come here. Just, just, just for a second, just for a second. Just for a... Hold on, 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 hold on. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to my Dark Souls 4 Let's Play. I got an early copy of the game, as you can see, Demon Souls. And uh, we're here in uh, the new dungeon. This is the demo level. As you can see, it's kind of more, it's, since it was the first Dark Souls, this is, this is more of an easy game. So the games are not that difficult, even if I, even if I remaster, like, come on, it's from software, you can do better than that. Just kidding. But I love kicking these guys' ass. Okay, you don't want to go down the hole, all right. You scared, eh? <laughs> Leak Dark Souls footage? Yeah, Demon Souls footage. I want to get my channel deleted from Sony. Okay, yeah, that's actually a very good point, Circus. They... They... Like... I think it is possible to, like, play Angel of Darkness without loading screens. Because it, it, it because it, it it was worked on the PS2 limits. That's a really good point. What did I put in here? Okay, and then and then what? Is there going to be a giant lever in here? 
Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Also that I need to find another one. Question being where? I think that I know where. <laughs> this is scary. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, whoa! That was not the answer. Oh. Never played Dark Souls. Oh, uh, some cuts. It's charming to be a very smart though. Only played Bloodborne. Well, I mean, I never played not not even a single game. I think that I only played Dark Souls, the first one. Like only the first level, and then I quit it because I'm not good at those games. I I don't have patience, <laughs> honestly, to learn those games. Like, I don't know. It's just I'm not I'm not the demographic for those games. I see now. I don't know, don't. Too late, you're drowning in the boiling water. You need to collect multiple shards from this room. Was Lego Indiana Jones? No fucking way. I love that game. I used to play the hell out of Lego Indiana Jones when I was a child. Yeah, even Lego Indiana Jones 2. 2. Like, the second game. What the f- Okay, I'm not sure, whatever. Son of a... Ow, 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 ow. Out. Croft! Should have seen that coming. Rats the old makeover flash game. Then PC was Tomb Raider too. Oh my god, amazing. Need to do a backflip off the wall. I was climbing. Trap is stressful. Yeah, yeah, it, it, that trap was amazingly. Like honestly, I wasn't not expecting that. I was genius. But the stress. So yeah, let's talk about that. Was like everyone who's in the chat right now, what what, what was your first game? Mine was Ratatouille for the Xbox 360. Like the first game that I ever owned. I mean, I, I I used to have a PlayStation one, but I mean, it wasn't mine. It was my sister's, so that's why. That did not work. All right, this is gonna be kind of stressful. I need to save in order to not go up the stairs all over again. Should I buy the PS5 on November? I don't think so. Usually the first, like, when people buy the new gen consoles in the first months, they actually come, like, defective. I'll say that you wait, like, a month or three. Uh, like, around... Two or three months. Uh, boss return was main. My first game was Kirby for Nintendo 64. Ah. Uh. Right. Out, 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 All right. I don't think that I can reach all the way up there. Save. Save. Ah, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, 
There we go. Bingo. Now I need one more. Free game I own. What's free game for games? For Christmas as a kid. Ah, that sounds amazing. Also, Christmas is around the corner. Well, that's that's actually Halloween. Then Christmas. Smash Bros. Melee Sonic Mega Collection. Right? Dude, what an incredible childhood you had for your first three games. Wait, I think you need to do a back with a shimmy. Well, uh, no. You don't need to. You need to go down again. There's a hidden chart. Wait. Go down again. Oh. <laughs> I see, I see, I see. Smash Bros. together a lot. Oh, what a dream. That sounds really sweet. Playing with your siblings. I really miss those times where, like, the PS1 era, where me and my, when me and my sister, my cousin, my, my sister used to bring her PlayStation to the, to my grandma's house. Should have seen them coming. <laughs> to my grandma's house, and we all used to, like, gather around other pizza and just play, like, Crash Bandicoot or, or Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> Like Crash Bandicoot or Tom Ryder back in those days. It was a really sweet time. And actually, fun fact, one of the first games that I ever had, like, it was the Xbox 360. But the first two games that we ever bought was Ratatouille for us, for me and my little sister. And Tom Ryder Legend for my big sister. And my god. Like, what a time. Like, I remember that it, it, even my cousin, who was a big fan of Tom Ryder, came, out, came, came to our house to play Legend with us. Like, my sister and him will play Legend, and me and my little sister will just watch. And my game crashed. She stopped moving for some reason. <laughs> it was amazing. What I like. I miss those times. And I'm going to relieve those memories once I play Legend. It's going to be it's gonna be hard to play Legend because of the nostalgia. Just for that. That's this cool. I played it too. You too, I played that. Ratatouille is really good, like, but sadly, Ratatouille is only good on Xbox and PS3 because I, I look the other versions of the game, even the PC, and they are bad. Like, they're just like, they don't even come close to the Xbox 360 and PS3 version. Oh, how can we do to get out of here? What the? I I guess Oh, I think that I know what I need to do Easy It's busy You know, just stay calm and speed Because I'm always winning <laughs> Easy What the fuck? What is that? Is that the oxygen thing that was inside the vials? Okay. Odd. Odd. Still cool. I guess that I'm gonna have to open this door after I go down there. I fucking love this jump. It's, uh, that's amazing. Uh, 
What is this? <gasps> the shard! I mean, the, the knife the thing. Yeah, the shard. I think it's a shard. So now I have the... So now I have the three of them. All right, Eclaror, Eclaror. Eckharts, bring it on, motherfucker. I'm ready for you. This is play that too, and was the game of the huh? For hell. <laughs> Rip. Oh shit, he actually got me. Generally, Legend probably has the best music in the series. Oh yeah, it's it's, it's, it's so cinematic. The credits then. Seriously. Sad face, wait what? Why is sad face? Hold on. Wait, ah oh, shit. <laughs> Whoops. Big mistake for my part. <laughs> Let's get this bread. Yeah. We finally got the three shots. Let's get this bread, gamers. Cause under my rule, we break free from the oppressive world we live in. Gamers. Both for me for president. And I'll, and I'll, and I'll give gamers another chance in society. <laughs> I love bread. Alright, I'll save it here. Let's go one more time. Just just because that was cool. Alright, now. Welcome to Tony Hawk Pro Skater, baby! Ten points. You're a rock star. Okay, no, that actually killed me. <laughs> Almost killed me. All right, I, f I have a funny feeling that there's gonna be something behind this door. I don't have my guns. Damn it. Fuck. Oh, here we go. Give me chocolate. <laughs> okay. Ah, shit. This not only smells but emanates boss fight in the making. I'm gonna lie, I don't have a good feeling about this one. I knew it. You! Okay, I have a gun. Wait, no. What the fuck is going on? Oh, boy, this is bad. Still really, alive, man? Miss Croft. Are you still I'm alive? Resilient. But over the decades, I've killed more mortals like you than I can remember. And In over the decades, I kill more like immortals than you can remember, As I motherfucker. Will now take yours. To wake this thing, you are grotesque. Only my great hearts can cause the higher race to flourish again. So I guess it's up to me to stop you then. Hell yeah. I hunted down and killed the last of the Lux Veritatis. I am immortal. 
Not for long. The shards. Scary, huh? For you. It is my destiny to breathe hell on Earth. You are nothing to me. Do you know, it's going to be a real pleasure to shut you up. Can I just say that I fucking love how fucking sassy she is? I'm so glad that Sassy Lara is back. <laughs> I love it. I fucking love it. Hold on, just give me a moment. All right, all right. <sighs> Edgar, this is your end. Bring it on, motherfucker. I've been waiting my whole life for this. Well, not my whole life, but the entire game for this. Bring it on, motherfucker. And I don't have my gun. I don't have my gun. What the fuck? Oh, what the? Bullet penetration, all right. So you want to play dirty, huh? I wish that I had my guns. <laughs> I have them. Why can't I get them out? You are so fucking dead, dude. You are so fucking dead, dude. Ah, shit. Nice try, baby. Gosh. Come on. Wait, hold on. Badass lines. You only need to shoot him when he comes in the middle. Yeah, Jonelle Eddie, like... Honestly, she really did a great job in that cutscene. I... I mwah, chef's kiss. What did he do? That's not the one that I wanted to load. Then where's your bullets? Oh my god. Don't wait. Okay, okay, okay. I'm not gonna waste my bullets. And where did I load? Where did I save? Oh yeah, here. Alright. Okay, only shoot him when he comes in the middle. <laughs> Motherfucker. Bring it on, motherfucker. You missed Curtis, I see. <laughs> yes, I missed him. I was gonna say, let's, let, let's play with him one last time. Honestly, I missed the guy. It would have been amazing to have him in here helping me. God damn it, Curtis, why did you have to die? I mean, I despise you, but I st at the same time, I love you, dude. So, God damn it, dude. <laughs> you gotta get in my nerves, Eckhart. You gotta get in my nerves. You don't already feel it. That's. That's. Not. No. Okay. That was my chance. I got a feeling that tonight is gonna be a good night. You are so fucking dead, Eckhart. Shit, it's not here yet. What are you doing? Say what? What? Okay, I cannot kill these guys. What are you doing, dude? What kind of Naruto Jiu-Jitsu is this? Is that it? Is that it? 
Whoa, fire, really? I see that you like to play dirty, I see. <clears throat> Where the fuck? This guy really saw Naruto or Dragon Ball Z and he really <laughs> it, it did something to his mind. Oh. I cannot see chat. I, I, I just see that a lot is happening in chat but I don't know what the hell is going on. Oh no, don't tell me that I'm going to stay in fire like this. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, there you go, doing that thing again, I guess. You can make your life so much easier by pressing crawl and... Why did I need any thought about that one? <laughs> There's so many controls in this game that I forget. I'm gonna get hit all. <laughs> Good point, the circus. Alright, um. Stop spoiling. What do you mean, stop spoiling? Chris would have died. This is a freaking thing. I'm not sure. Stop spoiling, please. Okay, it's not a spoiler. I, uh, I don't think that she's spoiling the game. Come on, I'll fuck her. Bring it on. Whoa! Okay. What is she doing? What is she doing? What is she doing? Sweet cheese, dude. You need to calm down. Oh yeah, I forgot. I can just <laughs> crawl. Oh, why do you know it works? <laughs> you might be an immortal being, but you are nothing to my prone strategy. <laughs> you idiot. There you go. There you go. Getting yourself some friends because you're lonely as ever in your life. Now look at him. He's making some friends. Loser. The entire time, no one to run in circles. Yeah, but I mean, it's more like... It's more... It's more entertain uh, enter 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 it's more entertaining to the circles. Cause it keeps me on my toes of the action. <gasps> Holy shit! Motherfucker! Ah, oh, for the real deal. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Toes is what? <laughs> this guy's oh, he teleports after he jumped to the other side. Come on, go do your shuriken, whatever Naruto thing you do. Oh, I messed it up. Oh. Damn it. There he goes. Come on, make yourself a friend. Oh. 
poor you. You don't have friends. You need to make it. Okay. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna shut up. <laughs> I made myself in my own words. Come on. How many bullets does it take to kill you? I know you're immortal, but I'm not that immortal. Sweet jeez. If I get hit one more time, I think that I'm gonna have to prone on these ones. Oh my! <laughs> the accident to roll into the wall. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of, I kind of messed myself up. Yeah, I think that I'm gonna have to like prone on these ones because they are hard to dodge, unlike the fire. Phew. You're immortal, but not that immortal. <laughs> They both were cool. Oh yeah, it's true. They both were cool shades, and both of them are kind of immortal. So what do you know? Lara is closer to her enemy than we thought. She's more similar to the, her to Eker than we thought. Now where do you go? There you go, making your friends again. Oh, yeah, my health. <laughs> Oops. Bang. 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 Bam. 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 If I could finish this game four weeks ago, I already forgot the boss fight. <laughs> Bang. Oh, son of a... No, get it got. Get it out, get it out, get it out. Ah. Son of a... What the fuck just happened? What the fuck happened to me there? I had like a stroke or something. I couldn't do anything. Come on, Necker. Bring it on. Ooh, scary. Even if I'm this close, he doesn't, like, bother to, like, oh, shit. <laughs> like, to aim down a little bit. He's like, oh, shit. I doubt Miss Croft. She's... She's smarter than I am. I don't know how can she avoid all my projectiles or attacks. She must be using some sort of dark magic. Some dark magic called prone. A tactic to surpass Metal Gear. Purpose in action on them after shooting the Eckhart twins. Wait, really? All right. Purpose in action after shooting the Eckhart twins. Square the fuck up. Okay, okay, that worked. What the fuck? Ah, uh, yes. You're still up? Okay. That's what I needed to do. 
Come on, the crawl, my biggest weakness. Oh, fuck. Holy shit, how can she have <laughs> She must be using a new tactic. I'd ever encountered an enemy this smart. All of my enemies just standing there and jump over my projectiles. She's just something different. But I can't quite put my finger on what it is. <laughs> but I know Echo did. Maybe. Maybe it's so emotional. <laughs> Okay, so I need to do that two more times. Got it. Nice, nice call out, Circus, because if you didn't tell me that, we would have been here for probably half an hour. What is he doing? Is he making friends? He's making friends. And health. Shit, I don't have a lot of ammo. Oh my god, I don't have ammo. Fuck. A cardius grande. <laughs> Dangerous woman. Oh my god. Dangerous woman featuring Lara Croft. <laughs> Perosha makes me feel. <laughs> Bring it on. No! No, no, no. I refuse to believe. I re I'm not going to accept that. I'm, I, I'm not taking that one. You love the song, though. Yeah, it's really cinematic. Oh, I'm in that. I can't remember. Come on, come on. Just gonna stand a little back. Stay close to the middle to so don't fuck it up again. I press forward. She's going back. Now. What the fuck? I'm here. Yes. And another one. You still alive, motherfucker? I actually need three of them. Alright. Here goes nothing, I guess. Mm. It's actual fact I made by a live orchestra. In actual fact. Oh, it was me, but I'm, okay. That's even way cooler. The like, cover chest, it's so beautiful. Especially the especially the menu music. Like the menu OST. It's absolutely beautiful. But yeah, I, I was actually going to talk about that the first time that I played the game. How, like, whenever people, like, whenever video games bring live orchestras or orchestras to their games, it's one of the best things ever. Because it feels like you're actually, it feels like, no, wait, I, I, there I go with the likes again. It feels like if you're watching a movie. This is just amazing. There you go. I'm gonna just wait for you to do your thing. No, wait, I don't. Hold on. And there we go.
save. Then, no, what are you... Okay, I don't think that I need to shoot him. I just need to... Square the fuck up on this guy. <clears throat> oh my god, I got him. <gasps> yes! Not so tough now, eh? What the? Corel? Go on, kill her. Join the dark side. Do it. <laughs> I knew you'd find the third shard. But why? You worked for him. No, unknowingly, he worked for me. But his usefulness was ended. Will you destroy his work? Of course not. The great work will be finished. I'm offering you the chance to become part of a benign new order in the world. You are kidding, right? We Nephilim have only ever been trying to survive. Oh, Too shit. Too many people have died for me to trust you, including a good friend, Von Croy. He was an unfortunate <gasps> victim of history, Lara. Eckhart was stupid to have killed him. I've helped you all along, both here and in Paris. Motherfucker. You can trust me, Lara Croft. Can I? I'm tracking five Obscura paintings for a client called Eckhart, but he's a psychopath. Why should I care? Because I'm being stalked. People are dying out there. Handle it, Werner. Lara, please. Look, go and see this woman, Carvian. She can help. I'm going. What? Egypt, Werner. You walked away and left me. There was no pity. Get out! Get out of the way! What the Roy, fuck? You located the painting for me. Why have you not delivered it? I daren't collect it. It's too dangerous. But she'll be able to. No! Oh, motherfucker. Your usefulness is finished. Piece of shit. Oh, you cocksucker. You are so fucking dead. You got them. You killed Von Kroy. Stupid mortal. So be it. Well, motherfucker. Send me the bill, cocksucker. Holy oh. shit, okay. <laughs> there it is. You're about to drop dead, motherfucker! Oh, fuck. It's not a gun. Okay. Um. Shit. Tranquilize your gun. Pow! Her eyes move in the cuts and. Fight Carol. Get to the top quickly. Okay. Bring it on, motherfucker! Ah, uh, where are the stairs? Bingo! You're about to meet your maker, you... F whatever your name it is. Ah! Oh, I knew it! Please don't shoot me, 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 please don't shoot me! Oh wait, there was another stair. Oh really dude? Really? You're here? Mm-hmm. Wanna surprise me? 
Oh my god, there's another floor. But I'm Lara Croft after all, motherfucker! Oh! I'm not... <laughs> I'm not taking that one. Cause I'm Lara Croft! Ugh. Oh, you piece of... Holy shit. So this is it, eh? Last chance, buddy. Last chance! What is going on? Where's the cutscene? I, I can't see it either. Hold on, where's the cutscene? What 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 happened? What happened? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. It's not over, it's not over. What the hell happened? Second try, I guess. <laughs> And third time is the charm. Third time is the charm. Shit, shit, shit. Third time. It crashed. Wait, what the hell is going on? What is going on? Don't go anywhere. Hold on. Hold on, is that... Wait, no, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Give me a moment, give me a moment. What happened? Just give me a moment, everyone. It's completely ruins the only... Hold on. What? No, that cannot be. Give me a moment, I can fix this. Probably is the name of the cutscene. Uh, Tom Ryder. I love that. Just because the cutscene broke and someone left the, the, the stream. The cutscene broke and someone left the stream. Like, God damn it. Ah, uh, bro's local files. Maybe the, the file, his name, it probably has the wrong name. Data, FMB1, or end, end credit, right? End credit. End. Save for all. Wait, hold on. So someone explain me. After that, there was only a cutscene, and then the game ended. Or there was more gameplay. Was there gameplay or just a cutscene? I I need to know right now to fix this. Cutting only a cutting. All right, I can fix this. What is it? What is it? Which what was the name? Okay, only a cutting. Okay, so that was the end of the game. End. Please tell me this one is. Yes. Please tell me this is the one. All right, all right. I think that I can fix this. I can I, I can access the file, so thank God that I'm playing this on PC. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have been pissed. Okay, let me look for the file. I know where the FMBs are. I just need to look for the end one. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I patched this. Even in the patch note says, the, the, the final cutscene can break, so install this patch to fix it. I did it. There it is. It's only playing the audio. What the fuck? It's only playing the audio. What? It's only playing... Why is it only playing the audio? 
Hold on, hold on, hold on. There maybe it's, it's in here. Video volume is broken. Oh no. No, 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 no. It's no, it's not. It's not broken. Please tell me that it's gonna play the video. Please tell me that it's gonna play the video. Up. It's fucking broken. It's broken. No, TP roll, TP roll. It has to be TP roll, right? I I remember that I downloaded a file with the ending cutscene that I <laughs> might have spoiled it because I wanted to make sure it was the cutscene. I didn't saw anything. I just was I just watched the the first frame of the video. This is not the one. I had it in here. I downloaded. Do this earlier. It's not this one. And credits, please don't miss the credits. Yeah, I probably have to gonna have to do YouTube. No, this is the fucking joke, the Fortnite joke. I prefer... <sighs> no, really? And reveal? Come on. I had it here. I'm so disappointed. Well, YouTube time. I'm so disappointed. Uh So, sorry guys. I thought that I fixed everything. Damn it! I thought that I fixed everything. What the hell? Well, I guess that you can't patch everything. Uh, Angel of Darkness. Got sin. Come on, really? Nope, hold on, zero, and then, uh, where's, 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 where's the browser? This is so disappointing, this is so sad. Uh, window capture. Tomb Raider, there we go. I'm so disappointed. But hey, uh, here we are. All right. What? Sweet. No, no, no. He was calling it? Wait, no. Was he actually calling it? So he's alive. Whoa, 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 whoa. So he was call this Hold on, ah, uh, here. So he was calling the thing. So he's still alive. He's not dead. What the fuck? So I was about to say, wait, we killed the bad guys. How the fuck is there like, like, how, why the fuck is, was there going to be a sequel? Oops, I didn't... I didn't play the whole cutscene in its glory. Wow, okay. Holy shit. Crying right now. It is what it is. <laughs> Let's close the game and then we need to have a chat. Sorry, I don't remember it well. It's fall 
No, 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 don't worry. Well, we think he's alive. Supposedly in the beta documents, he was captured in prison and Lara had to save him. I think he's alive. So yeah, he has to be alive. This, the fucking thing was going to his body and it was activated. My, my guess is like, do you remember the big guy, the bald one? Who was like big we never killed that guy he probably captured curtis and that's why we need to rescue him from that guy because that guy's still alive and he's it he has unfinished business with lara and curtis so that's why there was probably gonna be a sequel to the game to finish the business and then the third one was gonna be the curtis spin-off it makes absolutely sense i feel stronger now Wait, I have no yeah, the bald guy. My childhood crush is still alive. It has to be. If it's on the beta... On the beta documents. He has to be alive, along with that... Muscular bald guy. Holy shit, I can't believe. What a game. What a game. Oh my god. I'm so disappointed because the the final cutscene, I didn't fix the final cutscene. Ah, that really threw me off. But holy shit. What a game. We're not done yet. We're not gonna end the stream here. We still have some unfinished business. Oh my god. I love this song. And there it is, Eckhart. I, I, I thought that we were not gonna be able to kill this guy because Everyone told me it's a trilogy, and I was like, okay, he's probably gonna be killed in the second game. Never expected in this game. It's supposed to be a trilogy. But why the story didn't continue? I'm sad. I don't know, I was gonna be killing her in I don't know, with her or something. Let's make a petition. Yeah, I, I'll actually be down. I'm gonna look at the video in a moment. But I just wanna, I just wanna see the credits, because, I mean, we have to pay respects to everyone who walk in this game like holy shit <laughs> what an ending I mean the, the final cutscene was really fast paced but we get hope that Curtis is still alive and that makes me happy wow play a second Wow! It's incredible. I am just sad. I'm just sad and disappointed that I finished this game. I thought it was gonna be longer. Everyone told me like, oh, you still like, there's a lot of more of the game. But there wasn't. <laughs> People were just were trying not to spoil me that I was close to the end and that... That makes me sad. Because I thought the game was gonna be longer. Special thanks. I, I, I was. I, I, uh, I thought I was gonna say special thanks, and you, the player. She'll play cancel fan mate. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa! There, what, there's a cancel fan mate. There's a cancel fan mate. Oh, of course, I'm gonna play it. The dark crescent. Some Gito. Go! Holy shit! Wow, card sign. God damn it. Wow. What a... What a game. But we're not done yet. Cause... If you think we're done... I have something up my sleeve. I'm so disappointed. So disappointed. That How can they end it in such a cliffhanger? My heart. My soul. My everything. <laughs> Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, why can't I, why can't I move this? Hold on. If you think we're done, you're absolutely wrong. Cause I have a thing up my sleeve. 
Oh shit, you can actually... <laughs> Fuck! You can see that, I forgot to turn that off. Um, <laughs> whoops. I guess this, uh, the surprise is ruined now. But, we have this. I was actually planning to save this for later. But, uh... I, I, I was planning to do this when I finished the whole Tomb Raider... The whole Tomb Raider series, but I went... I was like, nah, I'm gonna do it with... With the... Uh, with the core idios, with the core design era, and then I'm gonna do another one with the whole series after I I'm done with it. It's a tier list, so you can know, like, which one is the best Tomb Raider, in my opinion. Alright, time to, um... Okay, time to catch up. You should play the cancel sequel? Yeah, I'm gonna play that. I'm gonna play the cancel sequel fan mate. Of course! <laughs> I love this game a lot. How am I not gonna play the sequel? Uh, imagine playing a Sekert though. Yeah, that, that would've been actually pretty sweet. It blew my mind when I can play as Curtis. Ekar would have been sweet. Very sweet ending. Search up some room. It's a Tomb Raider level editor. Holy shit, that's my first thing that on my wish list. After I'm done with the whole Tomb Raider series, I'm gonna jump to that level to that game. I also seen that a lot of people are doing like uh Curtis Chronicles. I don't know if that's canon or not, or just fan made. I'm I i want to guess that it's it's canon. Like it, they took like some files canon. Modify, it doesn't... Yeah, and it makes me a bit more emotional every time that I walk into it. Yeah. It is emotional because, like, she just disappears. And the next thing we know is that they cancelled the trilogy. That's a, that's actually sad. Can the engine the link on Twitter? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Please do. Oh, yeah, I've seen a lot of level editor games. Like, I, I think that i got to get to some level editor levels. Because they call my attention. Oh, ranking games, really... All right, time to do the tier list because I've been waiting to do this for quite a while. And of course, we're going to start with the first one, Tom Ryder. Now, I haven't played this recently. I played this like five years ago. Yeah, but from what can I remember? I mean, it's the first Tom Ryder, the one that I that brought Lara Croft to the glory. And sure, it's a little dated the game. The controls are a bit clunky. But I mean, I gotta pay respects. I mean, it's the first Tomb Raider. How can I dislike it? Uh, I'm gonna say that the first Tomb Raider has um, 8.5. I can talk a lot. I can. I cannot talk a lot about this game because I haven't played it in a while. But uh, I'm gonna give it a high rank because it's the first game. How can I not like it? But I can criticize the DLC because I remember this very well and it made my life miserable because i read that it was for pc for pc only and like really hardcore lara croft fans but i was just starting to play this game and it made my life impossible i wanted to cry because i the, the two last levels the one in atlantis and egypt made me want to cry because i got lost so many times i couldn't remember where to go and overall my experience I didn't enjoy it that much, especially because it was reused assets. I get it that it was the first game, but if we compare this DLC to Tomb Raider 2 Gold and the Lost Artifact, even even to the times, I know it was the first DLC, but I mean, I can't, like, I don't know. My I have some remorse for Gold because I still remember how hard was the last part in Atlantis. Like, it was a maze underwater. I cannot give it a high ranking. I will say, like, around a 6.5. It wasn't a hardcore Lara Croft fan. So I gotta give it this. I might, I'm gonna change these rankings later because I'm gonna play Tomb Raider 1, Gold, and 2 after I'm done with the series to relieve those memories because to like just stream the whole series because the, the these three games i played them before s doing the streams doing these streams so that's why i didn't stream them but i mean might as well go the all the way so after i'm done with shadow of the tomb raider i'm gonna play these games on open lara to see how they live up now tomb raider 2 
it is like it's the most iconic Tomb Raider in like in my opinion Tomb Raider 2 is one of the most iconic Tomb Raiders Tomb Raider pre last revelation sure a lot of people say it's their favorites but I, I think that I can speak from most of all all of us that Tomb Raider 2 has to be one of the most iconic Tomb Raider games in the whole series because whenever I hear the Tomb Raider game like the first thing that comes in my mind is the Wall of China and the Maria Doria. That's the first thing that comes in my mind. All right, what what are we talking about? It's a fan made game. Oh, sweet! TRL was supposed to be a sequel to Toby Garvin. No, no, no. Timeline. No. Oh. Okay. Premier Peru level. Oh. Wait. So Tomb Raider. So one being the worst and ten being amazing yeah it's a ranking system like it's from one to ten like ten is good and one is bad like it goes like that yeah like it, see circus even agree it's like tom rider 2 is an icon like i don't know if you guys can agree with me but in my opinion tom rider 2 has to be the most iconic it's the first thing that comes to my mind when i hear tom rider and of course i gotta give it a nine well no hold on hold on hold on It's the first in the series. No, I'm gonna give it like uh, an eight point five. I like it. I like it, but I mean, like an I uh, like an eight point seven, at least. It's good, but it doesn't improve a lot from the previous previous Tomb Raider. Sure, there's better cutscenes. There's better graphics. There's the jump backwards roll move. But I mean, there's some issues with Tomb Raider too. For example, Opera House. I really got lost in Opera House. And the Maria Doria, it was a nightmare. But there were some things that can foreshadow those mistakes. For example, the last level, uh, the Jade City, the, the Jade like Temple or City, whatever the name thing was, even though it was a confusing level and a nightmare, it had incredible design. So yeah, that's what I give it like almost the same score, a little bit better than Tomb Raider 2. Uh, I scored a little bit better than Tomb Raider 2 because it's almost the same game, a different story, but it didn't do a lot to improve uh, the whole thing. Tomb Raider 2 Gold, on the other hand, I mean, just no words. Straight, straight up a 9. This game, mwah, it was the first Tomb Raider game that I streamed. And my god, can I tell you about the level design? The level art, it was mind-blowing. The moment that I went into the Lapis Lazuli or the Blue Cave, my jaw dropped to the ground. Like, I thought it was going to be another game where they reuse assets, like, in the first, like, unfinished business. No, they, they took my expectations and threw them out the window. It was, like... Seriously, if you haven't played Tomb Raider 2 Gold, play it. It's, it's just mwah, beautiful. The whole art of the game. Then Nightmare in Las Vegas. What a crazy level. Level level design and level art. That's why it deserves a 9. It was just incredible. And the jungle. And the, and the, and the gold fountain or waterfall. It was just beautiful. This whole expansion can be resumed in one word and it's beautiful just beautiful or breathtaking like seriously going into that mine with the camera zooming out to show you the whole room just to see the blue colors and the faces it's it it, it steals your breath like you go wow it's amazing now my personal favorite like Tom Rider Tree. Edios just what Edios and Core went like, all right, here's Tom Rider 2. We're just gonna take that game, throw it out of the window, we're gonna do a way better game. Like a ten out of ten. Open world secrets, optional side quest, new guns, new sounds, new graphics, Lara with more costumes, vehicles. 
Uh, sure, the story is here and there. Not the best story. Amazing cutscenes. Despicable enemies. Sophia. May I need to say more? Sophia? <laughs> it's just... It's a completely new game. It looks like Tomb Raider 2. And it's a completely new game. Tomb Raider 3. Yeah, Tomb Raider 3 was a fucking upgrade. They looked at the mistakes they made on Tomb Raider 2. And they just went like, you know what? We're going to make the best game ever made on PS1. Honestly, Tomb Raider 3 is a straight up, it's a straight up 9. Also... Area 51. Area 51. The fucking alien going into Area 51, breaking in, and then going into a UFO. Are you fucking kidding me? Do I need to say more? It's a straight up nine. Oh, beautiful game. I like Tomb Raider 3 will always be my favorite Tomb Raider ever. Then we got Lost Artifact. <laughs> oh my god. Is the same as Storm Rider 3, like I explained. Open world, optional side quests, secrets. Especially the secrets. What the fuck? I, I'm sad that I didn't discover every single secret, but the one that I discover in the mines, a secret passage to fucking prehistoric world with pterodactyls, a fucking volcano? Are you kidding me? A sunken submarine. And then madhouse and then the reunion what and it had a story it actually had a story on like on like tomb raider 2 goal lost artifact was about looking the lost artifact that the doctor needed to don't turn into a monster honestly a masterpiece of expansion straight up nine straight up nine i mwah, loved it Holy shit, oh, hold on, oh, hello, welcome. Um, the globe, where you can pick, yeah, the globe, like, select your own levels. That was fucking amazing from Tomb Raider 3. I love Sophia, yeah, I love Sophia too. Like, it, it, the fanner that she has, it's amazing. Period. Oh, you you rate Tomb Raider 2 higher than Tomb Raider 1. That, no, wait, Tomb Raider 2 higher than Tomb Raider 2. Wait, what? No, oh, the expansion. It's... This one is Tomb Raider 2, and this one is Tomb Raider Gold. Because, mwah, beautiful. Tomb Raider Gold, uh, it's amazing. I love it. It has a special place on my heart. But hey, welcome, Lily. It's nice to see you around. Uh, sadly, you missed the ending of Angel of Darkness, but you're here to, like, <laughs> the tier list. <laughs> Team Tomb Raider 2. Yeah, it, see? Tomb Raider 2 is just iconic. Some people criticize it because it looks similar to Tomb Raider 2. Oh. The the cover, I think. Sorry, my head's not fully awake. Ah, oh, don't worry. Tom Rider too late than Tom Rider Chain. No. Tom Rider how dare you turn away? D Lily, come on. It's Tom Rider Tree. Open world, secrets, optional side quests, new guns, new everything. It's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> and Tom Rider 2, I mean it's good. It's good. Like I, I personally I love it, Tom Rider Tree. It's my personal opinion. It's not general. It's just a personal opinion. It can be controversial, but I'm sorry. Tom Raider 4. Oh my god. Tom Raider 4 is a difficult one for me. Amazing story. I gotta say, the best story in the whole Tom Raider series. Like, it's so fleshed out. Amazing characters. You can feel the relationships. But. And not, not only that, but graphics like this was on ps1 the things you can do the new abilities and the graphics they went out of the way hacked the fucking ps1 broke it down to its last bit to pull one of the most innovative games you can put on the ps1 in my opinion this has to be the best looking game in the playstation one i know in pc it had hd textures but i looked up Tomb Raider 4 on PS1, it still looked beautiful as hell. And the things you can do, the abilities, the animations, the movements, the mechanics, controllers. All done on PS1, too. Mwah. It's a masterpiece. The only issue that I have with this game is Lara Croft. She is a little bit more 
sexualize. I mean, you know what I'm talking about. If you look at the way she dresses, that's the only issue that I have. But I can get that it's fan service and it was the 90s. It was a different time. So I'm going to let that pass. Um, Her looks, though, on the... I have a... The last revelation, Lara Croft didn't... I don't know. It was weird to me. Because in in three in one, two, and three, if you see the textures of her face, it's normal. But on Tom Rider Last Revelation, the the lines feel thinner. And that really threw me off. I don't know, it made me feel uncomfortable. Her face felt like too small compared to the other Tom Riders. Not only that, but uh, the F and B sequence was a nightmare. Because you have all these normal looking people and then you have Lara Croft. Big eyes, big lips, square face. <laughs> she is standing next to other people on FMB sequence. It was weird. Everyone else looks so realistic, but Lara looked like a caricature or like like a tune. It was weird. I, like in my opinion, they should have reworked her. I know that her look is iconic, but when she standed next to other people that look really realistic, she just looked weird like an alien and that really threw me off and something else that i had with tomb raider 4 is that i love that it was a long game but it wore out like there's this there's these like lines that you can and cannot cross there's the there's the there's the games that are too short that leave you desiring more of the game then there's the games that are too long that you want to finish and then there's those two sweet spots where the game is just enough length that you feel satisfied and enough length where you want more and you want the sequel to come out already. Those two sweet lines are the best you can do. Tom Raider Re Last Revelation was almost touching the line where the game was too long that I just wanted to be done with that game. That's that's one of the issues. The F and B sequence and the and the looks of Lara Croft, I can let that pass. But the length of the game, honestly, I was kind of kind of annoying at the end of uh, by the end of the game, which is why I gotta give it an eight. It's a good game. I can see why many people love that game and consider it its favorite, but to me, it was not my favorite. It's still Tomb Raider Three. It's a good game. I can appreciate it. And honestly, it's a replayable game. I like honestly I can go back and replay it no no problem at all. And I I, I, I don't say that. I don't say that a lot. I, I don't say that very often about games. Re being able to replay them. But to last relation, I can replay this game, no problem. Because it was a good game. Hold on, let me catch up with chat real quick. Um for me it's on Tomb Raider 4 is like a Tomb Raider main cover. Yeah. Like, l l let me add that too. Honestly, Tomb Raider 4 didn't felt like a Tomb Raider at all. It had the Tomb Raider mark, but it felt like a completely new game. Like something that should have been in the next generation. But somehow, Core and Edios managed to bring it on the PS1, which is mind blowing and amazing. For me, Tomb Raider 4 is, is simply too long. And triple levels where you are to go back and forth, kill my brain the first time. Yeah, it actually like it was it it was a complete new game compared to the other Tomb Raiders that it for the first time playing it, it really threw people off. Especially me. I can see why. If I'm looking better in Tomb Raider 4 and Tomb Raider 5. Well uh, Yeah. Hi, hey, how's it going, Mr. Blue Sky? Welcome to the stream. My favorite game in eight. Don't worry, don't worry, Circus. It's just a personal opinion. But the time's exclusive. It's a short DLC, but holy shit, it's a beautiful DLC. It's the it's the starting screen DLC, like the starting screen of Tomb Raider 4. I never expect that to be a level. I, I I was expecting that to be a level in the base game, but no, it was a DLC, and it was beautiful. It, it had unique things, unique art, incredible lightning effects. I absolutely love this level. Sadly, it was too short that it left me desiring for more. I cannot criticize this game a lot because it's only one level. But it had 
it had it had amazing art and a cutscene for crying out loud the first dlc with a cutscene which is why i gotta give this game a solid seven i know it, it's not bad don't think it's bad it's good it's a solid seven i mean it's a well i mean yeah it's a solid seven it's one level but it, it's really good if you have not tried this game, I will recommend you to go and download the Times DLC and play it by yourself. It won't take more than 20 minutes. It's absolutely worth it. They did a good job. And just stop on every room and look around and appreciate the art. Because chef's kiss. Now. <laughs> oof, 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 oof. Chronicles. The length of the game made it special. It wore people out. Uh, for forever. Well, I, like I said, everyone has their opinions. This is my opinion. But to me, it really wore me out, the game. Let me see. That was neat. How it was the menu. Well, yeah, it, it, what a twist. Now, Chronicles. This is, this is controversial, all right? Because let's start from the beginning. It's the same as 4. We got some new things, some new mechanics, like crossing ropes and investigate, like searching cabinets. That that's pretty cool. It, it was kind of like uh, it it made the game feel more alive, sure. But let's talk about the story first, which is a. It's kind of a jikes. Tomb Raider Chronicles takes place on Tom on Lara Croft's memories. Because she's dead and her friends are remembering her adventures. Which, can I say, those cutscenes, whenever Wingstone, um, the archaeologist and the father were talking, I loved their relationship. It felt like really good friends. And you can, it felt like, like if you can sit down with them and just listen to their stories. That was amazing. Like, I really felt immersed on those cutscenes whenever they were talking about Croft's adventures. Like, they really invited you to be in that room with them, talking about her adventures, just being a spectator and listening. It was amazing. The stories, on the other hand, um, it's a jikes because they don't feel like Tomb Raider. Honestly, this game feels... It, it's a great game, but non-canonically, because it had a lot of action sequences. There were no tombs at all, or treasure hunting. The, the first mission, sure, but then it there it it felt like a fan made like if a Hollywood studio approached Core on Edios and they were like uh, yeah we wanted the saga we we, we want to make a TV series with your IP and they were like mm, best we can do is that you make a game oh all right uh, uh, sure sure we will we'll take the offer that's how it felt to me it didn't feel like a Tomb Raider game it felt more like a fan made action sequence fan service game it's a good game. But not in a canonical way. I can take Tomb Raider Chronicles as a uncanon game. Because there was just a lot of action and not puzzles or tombs. Also the characters mm, the characters felt like it was a teenage drama that was trying to do comedy. Sure I get that Lars and Pierre and the Russian guys uh, they they were good characters, but they didn't feel Tom Ryder at all, or, or 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 the ghost. It felt more like if they were trying to be on a comedy, teenage drama, which really threw me off. I was expecting more dr more like suspense or seriousness, but it ended up being this kind of weird com comedy series. I don't know. It, it it really threw me off. The only character that felt genuine was. Bon Croy and his elder assistant that was next to him and the guard that was talking to them. But other than that, it, was, it, it is a good game. I Personally, I love the action sequence, like infiltrating the submarine, escaping the submarine, the fucking... the, the fucking infiltrating Bon Croy's facility to steal like, like a secret engine in Mission Impossible and Sip. Can we talk about Sip? I, I yeah, I'm just so disappointed and sad 
that Sid, Sid never made a comeback. I love that guy. It, it was amazing. So, Chronicles also really threw me off because Chronicles is a, a case study. Let's talk about that. Tomb Raider Last Relation was supposed to be the last Tomb Raider in the whole series game because Core was tired of Tomb Raider. So tell me, why did they release Chronicles? Like, why did they release another game when Last Revelation was supposed to be the last game? Then they released Chronicles, which had concept art for the next generation. That being Angel of Darkness, a game that was supposed to be a trilogy. I talked about this before, but I want to bring it up again. So, did Core and Edios really wanted to get rid of Tomb Raider when they released two more games with the last one planned to be a trilogy? I think it was just a misunderstanding or probably something else. But Chronicles is kind of a case study that proves that Core and Edios really care about their IP. So, Chronicles has to get Chronicles has to get a 6 in my opinion. I love this game. I like I really do. But the story really really didn't like the story it didn't do it for me. I love the game, the gameplay and the characters and everything, but it doesn't feel like a like a canon game. It feels more like a fan made. I will put it higher up this game, but I mean I think that that will be a controversial opinion. There was the how it was the menu. What a twist! Uh, teenage drama, <laughs> teenage grandma, <laughs> oh drama. Prefer Tomb Raider Five as a dark game. It is always four. Was released because Aegis was close to being bankrupt. And oh, okay. It was sneaked in. Yeah, I, I heard that, that, that the ending of Tomb Raider 4 was sneaked in. Alright, now. <clears throat> we can guess which game is the elephant in the room. Angel of Darkness, one of the most controversial titles. The one that has the community so divided. Being the worst Tomb Raider of all time. Or the best Tomb Raider of all times. Angel of Darkness is... It's it's a weird thing. It's a completely new game. It, it's not Tomb Raider at all. Not in a single bit. I get it that the climb mechanics and the jumping and the controls can be same, but to me it didn't felt like Tomb Raider. Like not even the controllers, not anything. Just the just the looks of Lara. It's a completely different game. There's dialogue systems. There's NPCs. There's cash. There's a lot of mechanics that weren't used. For example, the cra the cash really threw me off. I thought that I was gonna use this really often, but no. Uh, you can only use it at the start of the game, where you collect things, sell them to a guy, and that's it. And you can make bets or like pay people to get guns. And the dialogue mechanics never came back. I get it that it, it was a neat little feature, but I was expecting more. The controllers are clunky as hell. Honestly, it took me a lot of time to get used to them. Sometimes they they were even unresponsive. Whenever I wanted to turn back, Lara would just walk back. It's, no, whenever I wanted to walk back, Lara just turned around. And the jumps were really weird. There's a lot of things they don't explain to you. For example, running and jumping, I didn't know it was a thing until you guys told me. Then crouching and then stealth to put my chest to the floor and prone. Another thing that I didn't know that was actually useful. Then changing targets with roll. Who the... F I'm sorry for these words, but who the fuck thinks that using roll to change targets, it's a good idea. When in past games, when you went shooting enemies, you can roll around to then change your direction of looking. Like... If you had experience with previous Tomb Raider games, you will never expect to change the targets. You need to use roll. Honestly, 
to me that was one of the stupidest things ever the engine sometimes get la gets laggy it can handle like a lot of the details of the game i can get why it was a rush game but still it, it, i feel like it didn't got a lot of play test the story has plot holes some minor ones in my opinion because i actually understood everything from the game and honestly i gotta say this story it's perfect in my opinion i loved it i actually like even if it feel like a teenage teenage drama series i actually love the series it had a great plot great characters honestly the the highest thing that i have to give to angel of darkness it has to be the story uh what else is there to be discussed we already talked about the mechanics oh yeah some cut mechanics like you never use everything at your disposal they give you a lot of ammo for guns that you can never take back which is something that really bothers me too. We didn't get to play a lot as Curtis. Something that bothered me too because like I really like playing it. Also, Curtis was really weird to use. But yeah, basically this game is it's it's something. It's ups and downs, ups and downs. It has good story, weird controllers, weird and new mechanics that are absolutely welcome. And I get it because Tom Raider is always trying to like change his formula and be one step ahead of the competition, which I can get. And honestly, like there was a lot of side, uh, there was a lot of side objectives that you can do that I didn't do, and I remember because I rewatched my streams and I was like, oh yeah, I could have gone to this place, but I didn't do it. There's a lot of open paths. Like honestly, Angel of Darkness remind me a lot to Tom Raider Tree. Because it felt open world. It, it 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 gave you side quests that you can do but you but you didn't have to. Which was amazing. It felt like an RPG. It it, it it's something special. It's something special that it needs to be studied. Like it's amazing. There there's just so many things that I can talk about this game. That I think that I need, I will need like another hour to explain this game. But on resume, great story, great open world, great side quests, great mechanics, absolutely clunky and terrible controllers. So yeah, it's it's weird. A a lot of glitches would really bother me. A lot of patches that I had to put to this game to work, and a lot of and the combat system. Can I just talk about the combat system? I'm sorry, but it's... It's terrible. It's absolutely terrible. You cannot jump and shoot at the same time anymore. Like, in Tomb Raider, in the classic Tomb Raiders, mobility and combat were hand-to-hand. -hand. Angel of Darkness were fighting against each other. They, they didn't... They, they couldn't be in the same place. Mobility and combat. It was terrible. I'm sorry. I have to say that. That's how I feel with the controllers. But. Yeah, I think that I talked enough. So, without the way. Tom Ryder, Angel of Darkness. <sighs> this is going to be. Some people are going to get mad, probably. But. Tom Ryder. Angel of Darkness, in my opinion, has to get a I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Angel of Darkness has to get a 9.5 for a game to have me wishing more. <laughs> like, for a game that had me drop my jaw every single time to take one character that I fucking hated, turn it around and make me love him and actually miss him when he died. 
<laughs> and then the ending. Uh, Angel of Darkness is absolutely a case study. I love this fucking game. And I know that I say Tomb Raider 3 is my favorite game. But I had to I had to save that surprise because Angel of Darkness is my favorite game. I honestly want to do everything in my power to get to to make interviews with with ex adios and core developers. And honestly, like I'm gonna do that in the future. I'm gonna try as hard as I can to get in contact with the writers and see if they can release the sequel. The sequel, what is it called? You know, the the sequel scripts to the public as a fan made script, as a fan made thing, so the so the so the fans can take it and and build it in Tomb Raider level editors. I don't know, but this game makes me want to do things that are impossible. I I actually want to contact the developers. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna see the credits later, and I'm gonna look those people on LinkedIn. LinkedIn, where people actually post their profiles of jobs and things, see if I can get an interview, and then do a case study in this game, because I'm actually making a video about this game on the main channel. But other than that, it, it, it's just, it's, I know it's a bad game. I know it's imperfect, but that what's ma that's what makes this game unique. So many new mechanics that, that we're supposed to have these like they were trying okay I'm, I'm i'm out of words angel of darkness was supposed to be probably one of the best on writers games but it couldn't and i can see that and honestly i can appreciate that they redid and remastered this game so many times that shows core really care about this game and they wanted to do a lot of things with it it just makes me, it makes me sad that it couldn't reach its full potential Angel of Darkness has to be one of one of one of the biggest enigmas in game history ever. And I really want this game to reach its full potential. So I know that I'm just someone on Twitch, some small guy on Twitch that's just doing gameplays, but I mean I'm gonna try my best to get uh Tomb Raider Angel of Darkness 2 scripts released as a fan made story because someone told me that the writer of Tomb Raider Angel of Darkness 2 wanted to release the scripts as a fan made story and I'm gonna do anything in my power to reach to that guy and make make the script be released to the public because I know that the community is gonna grab the script and build it in a Tomb Raider level editor so we can get an official Angel of Darkness sequel like I love this game. I don't care what people say. To me, this has to be one of the best games uh, in the Tomb Raider series. Introducing NPCs, optional dialogue, different endings, new guns, like the taser and the tranquilizer, amazing mechanics like prone, running and jumping. I don't know, like, this game is special, and people need to know about it. And I like a lot of people say that that uh, an Angel of Darkness remaster won't happen, but I want to believe that it will, and something good is gonna come out of it. So yeah, I like. I don't know. I I, I really want. To, I really love this game, and words cannot express the feelings that I have towards this game, towards this game. So. Yeah, that's Angel of Darkness. It's uh it's not a perfect game. But uh I can I can see past the imperfections and see what Core wanted to do with it. And that's what makes it one of the best non writer games ever. Because they really had ambition. They couldn't succeed. But it shows that this probably could have been the best non writer ever. And I can appreciate that. And I can show that by giving it a nine point five out of ten. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, Angel of Darkness is my second favorite Tomb Raider ever. I thought it was the first one. <laughs> People like Tomby and Jimmy told me that you love like like Angel of Darkness was your favorite game. <laughs> the question is, Curtis really dead? I doubt that Curtis is dead. We saw at the ending that the thingy went to go back to him, which means he's fucking alive. 
Plus, he's like an immortal being. He has powers. We all have seen Star Wars and how Palpatine used the Force to stay alive all these years. It probably could have been Curry's case, too. The Roy wants to release him. Yeah, that's what it says. Hey. Follow John. Wait. John L. Hillion has an Instagram. I think that I saw that one time when I went into it and everyone was talking about, oh my god, John Elliot, John L. Elliot. And I was like, what the fuck is going on? So she has an Instagram. <laughs> All right. I think that I'm going to have some conversations with her. I'm going to try to reach her out. If she, Even if she says that, ah, oh, if you want an interview with me, I'm going to charge you. Like, I don't care. I'm going to pay you. I want to have an interview with you, no matter the cost. <laughs> I'm going that way. E even with the developers. If they want money, I'm going to give them money as long as I can get an interview. I'm going all the way. I'm 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 gonna run, and when I and when I can't run anymore, I'm gonna start walking, just to squeeze the everything from this game and give it to the people, so they can recreate this game on a new engine, mod the mod mod the game that are, mod the engine that already exists, or do a level editor. But I mean, the information needs to be out there, and people need to know it. Told you that. Uh, your ambition. <laughs> the right now is a custom level series. Cal yeah, I I actually saw that that Doggett is doing that the the series of Curry Strain Chronicles. My baby and always first place. Ah, Tom Rider too. Okay, so yeah, we can agree that Tom Rider two is iconic. I want to believe. Oh my god. So wait, Lily. Um, the Curtis Chronicles are canon or they just fan made like. Are there, like, the developers released a script of Curtis and the levels are, are based on that? Or is it just like a fan-made thing? Rack is also on the Discord. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Freaks right the Discord. She's a mother. Oh, right. Uh, okay. Yeah, I actually need to join the Discord. I forgot. If you can send me the link on Twitter, I will appreciate that, Rose. Like, yeah, this is, this is the, this is my tier list of Tomb Raider, of the Tomb Raider games. Now, what's next on the series? It's not over yet. I'm not going to end the stream here. Well, I'm actually going to end the stream here and start a new one. Because we got to go to, we got to go to the best trilogy in all Tomb Raider of all. Oh, custom levels. Yeah, but uh, is it canon or is it fan-made? Like, what I'm talking about is, it like, are the Curtis Trent Chronicles based on a developer slash canon script or story? Or is it, like, a fan-made story that they turn into custom levels? Oh, yeah, the video of the... Of the what is it called? 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 North cheek, North cheek, North cheek. I forgot the name. Like it was the North cheek, but I forgot which one was. I I'm stronger now. I'm stronger now of North cheek. All right. I can't believe that I'm gonna close this game. It's been it's been a good one. All right. I'm going to watch a video real quick about the nose cheek, and then we're going to move to Tomb Raider Legend. Because I'm... Mm, expect me to fangirl a lot on that game. Because it's the first Tomb Raider I've ever played, personally. Not the, one, not the first one that i ever seen. The first one that I ever got my hands on the controller to play it. I, I, I Legend has a special place in my heart. All right. What's it called? What's it called? Uh, I feel... So Stronger than Norse chick. Custom levels are our fan mail. Oh, okay. Well, okay. So we got the. I need to write this down. Hold on. Um, Curtis Chronicles. Curtis Chronicles. Let me write that down. For, what's the Curtis? And what other game? I I have to play another one. Like I I think it was you, Circus, who told me that there was a fan-made sequel in in Tom Raider level editor what was the name to write it down if it's stronger now the Norse chick it's a techno <laughs> song I'm not gonna get 
Okay. I'm not going to get like a DMCA, right, for this. There we go. After Legend, I could play New York Tom Rider because I'm popular opinion. I think it's hot. <laughs> no, don't worry. That's that's your opinion. I also watch Angel of Darkness by Steve O'War. Oh, yeah, I actually saw that. That guy is really popular on the Tom Rider community because he did a lot of reviews and managed to get an interview with co with one of the core developers. I need to shimmy. Uh, yeah, I need to shimmy. What? <laughs> I feel really aqua. Oh yeah, that's the cutscene that I saw on Twitter. That someone tweeted the, the deleted cutscene. Deleted. I, I already saw it on Twitter. The deleted Angel of Darkness cutscene. It blew my mind. Like the shaman that rescued her and the amulet. It it makes it makes sense. Like it gives. The be it gives it gives the game more sense on why she's getting stronger and things like that. <laughs> A techno song. When was when, when was this made? 2020. I was about to say if I, I think this was made on 2013 for techno to be popular, but no. <laughs> Oh my god, I gotta cry. Just seeing that bit of the cutscene really makes me tear up. I want to believe that Curtis is alive. It has to be. It the, the beat kind of reminds me to a guy that makes songs about commercials. I don't know what was, what was the name of the guy, but there's a person on YouTube that makes songs about commercials. And it, it, it's giving me, this song, see, it's giving me strong vibes about this guy. That was it? No, that was so short. Oh my God. No, I wanted more. All right, let me like it. Oh yeah, I'm I'm on incognito mode. I'm not in my main account. I'm gonna give it a like later. But wow, okay. I didn't know that she made music. Oh, I need to shimmy. The intro is really weird because of the <laughs> mm, those, those sounds out of context. Um <laughs> Yeah, they, they speak for themselves. <laughs> The robotic music. I I should react to more than Narshik. Uh, yeah, I should, but I mean, I, I don't like being a react channel. I <laughs> I feel like it's kind of a I don't know. I don't, I don't like reacting because I'll I will rather recommend people to go and check her out than they watch me react to her stuff. I'll rather people like they should go and give her the views instead of give me the views of her stuff so yeah for those who don't know that Narshik if you if you like Tom Ryder check her out she's like a meme god of Tom Ryder <laughs> yeah we, we we can clearly see about this I mean I like Tom Ryder legend you don't have to be so rude my feelings <laughs> I'm just kidding yeah she has a lot of videos and I gotta say I love uh, some of her videos um questionable questionable thumbnail here but uh yeah <coughs> so no hi 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 <laughs> now you know my stream left setup damn it but yeah i'll probably gonna watch uh i'll probably do reactions to her videos later but right now we have to move on to Tomb Raider Angel of uh, Tomb Raider Legend. So don't go anywhere. I'm just gonna end the stream here real quick, and I'm gonna start another one with Tomb Raider. Uh, Tomb Raider Legend. So stick around for that one. It's uh, it's gonna be a good one. I personally loved it.
so I'll give me a moment. But uh, okay, I'm just gonna do the outro real quick. I'm not going anywhere. I just wanna do the outro for the video for the people who's gonna watch the stream later on the on YouTube, where I upload the the whole streams. So, thanks a lot for watching. I seriously appreciate every single one of you, lurkers, chatters, and followers. Like, for you to be with me on this journey in the classic games i don't know it's it's amazing and it's sad that we are gonna move on from the core era of tomb raider they were really good games i i, I love them i'm glad it happened but at the same time i'm sad that it's over but what can you do i guess we the only thing left is just to move on thanks a lot for watching and uh, I'll see you in the next stream of one. So have a good one. Don't go anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. I'm just doing the outro for the for the YouTube thing. So yeah, I'll see you in in five seconds when I restart the stream. So yeah, go get yourself a glass of water or some popcorn. I'll be back.